Well, without PE or gym class, how will students balance getting the physical time they need with their academics? Texas Today's Maria Aguilera spoke with a sports doctor who has some tips for doing it from home. Good morning to you, Maria. Good morning. Students have been home several months with limited physical activity due to closures. And whether they're returning to school in person or online, it's important they stay active. The CDC recommends one hour of daily physical activity for kids and teens, and they say you can split it up throughout the day. It can be going on walks, it can be riding bikes, it doesn't have to be during a certain time of the day, but it's good to make it fun, be creative with it. Have a small PE class with your kid and do jumping jacks inside. Dr. Laura Irvin with Baylor Scott and White Sports Medicine and Orthopedics says now with virtual learning, it's important to give your kids breaks and go outside. Early morning or late evening are good times to avoid too much sun and dehydration. There is a challenge right now in Texas with our heat of being mindful to keep our kids safe while we get this physical activity done, but it really is making it as much of a routine as possible. Not only does physical activity actually help kids focus and it's good for their mental health, but also prevents long-term diseases. Right now is the age where they can prevent themselves from having diabetes in the future, having high blood pressure in the future, not only what they do now, but instilling those habits at a young age will help them stay healthy for life. As a parent, Dr. Irving says the best way to get your kids to be active is to lead by example and do it together as a family. We have more resources to help you and your family stay active on our website, kcntv.com. Maria Aguilera, 6 News, back to you.